Hello and welcome my friend. Here is car doctor Peter Finn. And next I am planning to give you information that what is and actually how works you we liked. And now I am meaning ultraviolet light. What we can generate like in flash light what is in here. And this is specific uh, ultraviolet light and there is specific pulp in there what generates this ultraviolet light. And we can purchase these lights in any hardware store or then in ebay.com in internet. And we need to only insert in Google search that ebay.com and then UV LED plus light. And then we can get light what looks like in this. And this is very similar light than this standard plus light like this magma magma light what is in here. And it works actually almost similar. But only difference is that this pulp in there it is diff different and also this UV light is dangerous. And that's my friend, remember, do not ever watch ultraviolet and UV light what comes like in here. And now I saw that I pressed that button and now we don't look that area even that we can see that there is now this light. And now I don't, now I turn on and turn off. And do not ever watch directly this light. Because if we compare that standard light, where is this press button, in that light we can watch. But do not never watch this ultraviolet light. Only press on and direct in here. And this light is like a little bit blue when we look look carefully. It is blue light what comes in this area. There we can see that this is blue and then this normal light. It is white. Now we can see. This is the difference. And then this ultraviolet flash light they works normally. Like in here when I, I check these, these batteries there are standard AA Max Maxell battery and this looks just similar. Only difference is that this is ultraviolet light and how we can how we can notice that this is ultraviolet light. Only sign is that this light is blue. Look, it is in that kind. Now it's blue. And then the most important thing is that when we go to test soon that how this ultraviolet light find different colors in darkness. We go soon dark room and then we can see really big difference between that normal light and then this very interesting and dangerous ultraviolet blue light. Okay, and then my friend you might think that in what purpose we need that ultraviolet light. There are many areas, but the most common area is that we are looking some leaks or evidence. And police officers, they use this ultraviolet light when they are looking for blood and any that kind of stuff from human body. Blood. Because this light can see blood drops in that table, but this normal light it can't. And this is like police investigators standard tool in USA and all other countries. But in my case I am not looking for blood, I am looking for leaks. 
And these leaks, they are very common in engines, like car engines or motorcycle engines. And for that purpose, we can purchase specific these pre-mix coolant liquids what works with ultraviolet light. And there is one example what we can purchase in ebay.com and this is made in Italy. Italy is Ferrari's home country and Ferrari cars they use that device I believe when there are leaks in Ferrari Formula One engines or Ferrari sport cars. And maker is this uh, Aircom and they do this brilliant brilliant coolant and this liquid is like yellow and now we can see that, that this is yellow but when we go in darkness this is like sunshine it is totally different than water and then we can also purchase from ebay.com this this uh, brilliant engine and this is gr uh, gray div green green liquid and this is made for engine leaks if we have leaks in our engine we can insert that green liquid and it is also ultraviolet liquid similar than this coolant leak liquid okay but then my friend we go to dark room and then I can show to you that what are these great benefits in ultraviolet light and let's go to my dark testing room next okay my friend and now we are in my testing room and here is this my standard magma light white flash light and in that light we can look because it is normal and now we can look this my testing rooms this ground and floor area and we can see that it looks quite normal there is not anything specific and then I turn off this my light and now we are in darkness my friend and next I take my ultraviolet light and then you my friend you can see really interesting things and soon I turn on my ultraviolet light okay and now we are looking things with this ultraviolet light and there was rule that do not ever watch this ultraviolet blue light because it is dangerous this light is dangerous to our eyes and that's always turn point this our flashlight this ultraviolet light in other direction than people's head and now we I like to show you in this testing room that what we can see and now when we look in carefully that testing area there is something really strange in this floor area in here we can see some painting and let's go to look that little bit closer that can we see in there something in here in that area when we look in there there is some right curve and this markings in this uh, mattress and this floor area in here and in that point we can see that now there is some evidence that there is something in here and now I am meaning that area here we can see maybe some markings in here this circle and there has been happened something in there and using that light ultraviolet light we can see that evidence but then we have best thing and now I will show that how works this ultraviolet light really and there it comes look this is this coolant liquid ultraviolet coolant liquid look and it is like totally shiny and this liquid is that liquid 
what we are looking for these leaks and look how this uh, yellow it is because it includes particles what reacts with ultraviolet light look and this is really interesting it is so yellow and then when we look that ultraviolet light bottle with standard flash light now I turn also that then we can't see anything difference because now we have normal flash light and it, it looks only bottle but then when I insert this my ultraviolet light in same time we can see that this becomes shiny it is really yellow this is ultraviolet and standard light look and this is the idea that in normal light we can't see anything different but in ultraviolet light we can see that it is really shiny this is excellent and this is idea that we can find things in any materials what is ultraviolet light what is invisible in normal light and that kind of information my friend and thumbs up and see you in next movie my friend